My name is Cord Sangsteak. I'm a design engineer here at Sheldon Manufacturing. And today I'm going to be introducing the Baxtron 600 Anaerobic Chamber, a cutting edge solution designed to provide reliable, contamination free anaerobic conditions for a wide range of laboratory applications. This spacious workspace is built to support high throughput anaerobic research, clinical diagnostics, and industrial microbiology, uh, providing an oxygen free environment with unmatched precision. Now let's take a look inside the unit. The first thing that you'll notice is the spacious vacuum pass box. This features a drawer, a sliding drawer, to allow you to introduce large amounts of samples or any devices you want to have inside your chamber without disrupting the environment. Behind the doors, you'll see the convenience outlet. This allows you to power any auxiliary devices you want to have inside your chamber while it's operating. Located above the uh, convenience outlet is the manometer. Uh, this is a water-filled device that allows you to keep positive pressure inside the chamber while it's running. Located to the right of that is the drain tube. This is where you can collect water uh, that is produced by the condensate control right here. This, coupled with the catalyst, uh, which is made out of palladium, um, is what actually scrubs the oxygen from the chamber. Moving on, located in the center, we have two spacious shelves uh, to allow you to mount anything that you would like. Then on the right, we have the large 600 uh, Petri dish incubator. The Bactron 300 has a 300 Petri dish incubator located in the middle, whereas this one is on the side. The, the control is the exact same, um, just with bigger capacity. This features a Lazy Susan style shelf design uh, to allow you to rotate and access your samples easily without actually having to get inside the incubator. Now, let's take a look at the rear of the unit. First thing that you'll see is the main power inlet. Each unit must be connected to a properly grounded electrical outlet using the included power cord in the ship kit. For information related to further electrical safety, as well as installation instructions, including clearances, please visit your user manual. To the left of the power inlet, you will find the externally located vacuum fuse. Uh, this allows you to replace the fuse easily should you need to. Additionally, you will see the foot switch connection here. This allows you to um, connect the included foot switch um, to allow you to operate the sleeve controls without using your hands. This is the vent, this is linked to the manometer. Um, this should vent out any excess pressure that's inside your chamber, um, although this isn't a normal operation. Last, you will see the nitrogen and the AMG inlet on the left side of the unit. This is where you connect your gas supply. Uh, now that we've got the unit plugged in, let's get it powered on and take a look at some of the control panel functions. First thing that you will notice is the incubator control. Uh, just like the Baxtron 300, this is a digital temperature control with up and down arrows that allow you to set, monitor, uh, and calibrate your temperature set point as you see fit. One thing to note is that this only controls inside the incubator, not the workspace itself. Moving below, we have two indicator lights, uh, one to indicate that the commission cycle is running, uh, which we'll talk about in a second when we go over this side control panel as well as an AMG injecting button uh, to let you know whether or not you're injecting AMG. Below, you have the airlock and the sleeve controls. Uh, these function basically the same. Uh, it's a digital pressure switch that allows you um, to monitor the, the pressure inside the, the vacuum pass box and the sleeves. The pass box has its own button to initiate a cycle whereas the sleeves are initiated using the foot switch that we mentioned earlier. Located on the right side of the unit is the side control panel. Features various functions. Um, one of them is the workspace commission cycle initiation switch, as well as uh, some additional airlock functions such as number of cycles um, and manual operations for the pass box. You will also find the OTL knob, which is a safety feature to help prevent overheating of your unit. Lastly, in each ship kit, a light fixture is included. This is included with its own power cord as well, 
Um, it's an independent power supply, um, but you can use it to illuminate your workspace. Whether you're conducting clinical research, pharmaceutical testing, food safety testing, or micro, industrial microbiology, investing in the Batron 600 anaerobic chamber from Sheldon Manufacturing is a strategic decision that enhances laboratory efficiency, accuracy, and workflow.